Everyone loves to visit a clean beach, right? Well, students and staff at Ocean Lakes Elementary, along with some talented volunteers, are sharing time in an after-school club, designing a robot to help keep those beaches beautiful. Oh, good, you're already in the right folder. Um, but this is where you're going to write the program. 18 students are part of the after-school club. This is the STEM Robotics Club at Ocean Lakes Elementary School, and we're preparing for the STEM Robotics Challenge at the end of May. Um, these students are finishing up their uh, circuit boards that will serve as the transmitters and receivers and essentially the brain of the robot. And while students are using their brains to tend to those soldering needs, the real brain power behind the operation lies in the volunteers who assist on a weekly basis. Our volunteer help has been amazing. Uh, I have parents, at least five to seven parents weekly that are coming out. Um, my parents have been coming out since October. Uh, they provide technical support. There are mentors for these students. Um, they provide professional uh, tips and tricks that I wouldn't necessarily think of because they're electronics engineers, um, they are project managers for uh, electrical firms, uh, they're electronics technicians from the military. Um, they have invaluable experience and they have really made the difference in this program. During these hands-on activities, volunteers offer assistance as well as guidance to club members. I'm soldering on my soldering board so that the robot can move and operate the way that we want, want it to. Well, so far I've learned that first, building a robot is not easy. Second, I have learned that each individual part does its own function, so if you don't put it in right, it's not going to work. While students kept busy soldering the boards, mentors made sure things ran smoothly. You know, you can go to Walmart and build a, get a car and put batteries in it, but what's the steps it takes to get that car to work? And this is what they're learning. They're going to be programming the remote controls, the robots, every part of the step to, for the, to get ready for this competition in May. Division-wide, volunteers spend hours of their time helping teachers and students. This after-school club brought members of the workforce and their kids together to work on the project. It means an awful lot for us to to be able to uh, volunteer where my daughter is. Um, personally, as a, as a woman in um, the electronics and technology fields, um, engineering, being able, to, being able to mentor young girls and an understanding of what technology can do for us is really, really important, and especially with my daughter. And if you'd like to see those robots in action, Mark your calendars for May 31st and plan to attend the competition. It's taking place at the Convention Center. Log on to vbschools.com for more information.